Hi, and welcome to Brick Maths. In today's video, we're going to be looking at adding decimal numbers. It's important to have a good understanding of the place value of tenths, hundredths and thousandths before watching this video. Here is a calculation. 1.432 add 3.517. We're going to use column addition to work out the answer. It's really important to line the numbers up correctly when you're doing column addition. So we have the ones, then we have the decimal points, then we have the tenths, then we have the hundredths. And then we have the thousandths. Now that our columns are set out correctly, we can add the digits. Remember, when we use the column method to add and subtract numbers, we work from right to left. So we start with two thousandths, add seven thousandths, which is nine thousandths. So now we need to add three hundredths, add one hundredth, which is four hundredths. 4 tenths add 5 tenths, which is 9 tenths, and finally 1 add 3, which is 4. Make sure you put the decimal point in the correct place. So the answer is 4.949. Here is another calculation. 6.735 add 2.256. So first we need to line the numbers up correctly. Now that our columns are set out correctly, we can add the digits. Pause the video to give you time to work out the answer. Press play when you're done. So we start with 5 thousandths, add 6 thousandths, which is 11 thousandths. We carry the 100th below in the hundredths column. So now we have the hundredths. 3, add 5, add 1, which is 9. Now we add the tenths, 7 add 2, which is 9, then 6 add 2, which is 8. Make sure you put the decimal point in the correct place. So the answer is 8.991. Let's look at one more. 3.184 add 5.758. So first we need to line the numbers up correctly. Now that our columns are set out correctly, we can add the digits. Pause the video to give you time to work out the answer. Press play when you're done. So let's start with the thousandth. 4 add 8, which is 12. We carry the 100th below in the hundredths column. So now we add the hundredths. 8 add 5 add 1, which is 14 hundredths. We carry the one tenth below in the tenths column. So now we can add the tenths. One add seven add one, which is nine. Then finally we have the ones. Three add five, which is eight. Make sure you put the decimal point in the correct place. So the answer is 8.942. So that's it for adding decimal numbers. If you want to keep learning, keep an eye out for more videos by Brick Maths.